what's going on everybody and welcome to the third beer channel and a happy new year today is actually january 1st 2024 i want to thank you guys for joining me on this this channel i got we already hit 200 subscribers already before the new year so i'm really really stoked about that today i just wanted to come out and do some fishing and get get a first day of fishing in we're not doing a whole lot we're just out here at a place called castaway point here in palm bay florida i brought some shrimp out here and uh some worms and we're gonna just just see if we can catch something i don't care what it is even if it's a catfish let's just try to catch something and just have a good day so that's what we're gonna do so thank you guys for being here make sure you have a if you haven't already make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell notification icon so you know when i upload a new video and let's get fishing yep probably a cat i don't know there's stingray could be stingray yeah it could be it's heavy might be a stingray, bro. Yep, it's a stingray. Yeah. Alright. Alright, guys. Here's a stingray. Let me get him in the sun so everybody can see him. Cool little stingray. There's his barb, which we do not want to get on. That's pretty cool. I'll show you how I get him. Pick them up, bite their tail, and throw them with the fire. Yeah, I don't take any chances. And pretty. <laughs> I'm too clumsy, and I will get barbed. <laughs> he didn't catch one either. Another little sand perch. I caught two. This is my second one. This is probably the biggest one I've ever caught. But we're catching fish. Not many, but we're, at least we're catching. Let's see if I can get this hook out. There we go. Third beard fish. See ya. Alright, so fishing is going really slow. I've caught a stingray and we've been catching some of them little sand perch people call them white perch too but i have this teeny tiny and i mean itty bitty little t tiny hook it's one of the smallest hooks i have it's not on a sabiki rig and uh i've got it baited with just these ever little tiniest little sliver of shrimp and I, i'm just screwing around here playing with these little tiny uh perch i've got my other lines baited too with like cut shrimp and i actually have one that's out there right now that's baited with one of those sand perch too a uh, live one so we're gonna see but we're just gonna toss this out and see if we can keep catching them because they're kind of fun to catch so hard-fighting little fish. This is a good size one, too. <laughs> oh, he's he's hooked pretty good. Kind of bloody. So 
Let me get him off the hook real quick. <laughs> it's fun. Oh, had him. Just little boogers. But when the fishing's slow, they're fun to catch. Get it back out from that spot. Boy, this rod, this reel, sounds rough. This is an old used reel got at the flea market. Just need some oil. Got him. <laughs> so, like I said, these are called sand perch or white perch here in the indian river a lot of people i had somebody here just a little while ago telling me that these are baby snook but they're not come on buddy open your mouth open that mouth ouch This is a good size one actually in, in comparison so here we go little white perch it, these are pretty good size compared to some of the other ones that i catch but uh they're pretty cool they look kind of like croaker or uh whiting at least in body shape size they got a pretty open mouth and they got pretty sharp little gill plates they got little spines on them up here at the top right here but they're fine little fish. They, they make good bait. I lost a really good big fish out here on one of these once. They haven't gotten any bites since. But they're fun to catch when you're not catching anything else. And they're better than catfish. So, didn't catch a fish, but I definitely <laughs> caught a crab. <laughs> Do you, can you keep nice those? One. You know, I don't know. I, I would imagine you can. Yeah. And I, would, I know people go crab, you know, crabbing or yeah, whatever. They do but, a lot of that around. Yeah, yeah but I don't cool. know about the blue crabs. Yeah, they bring no. little crab they traps do. and they put them down here. Yeah. And they get full I don't know if there's a season. But there's, that is a monster, yeah, though. That is the biggest blue crab I have literally ever seen yeah, in my life. Yeah, I've seen this one. Good luck trying to get here. it. Here you go. Flyers. Right here, buddy. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Cool. Yes, sir. Crab soup. Yeah, really. Good job. It's a nice crab, man. <laughs> yeah. Happy New Year. Nice. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Happy oh, New dude, Year. you're you're crunching your own shell. I was told them are fantastic bait. They are. This one's too big for that, though. No. Don't think so. No, I seen the way dude hooked them. He took and cut their legs off, and then he goes. He went, cut their legs off right here, and then put the hook down through there, and come out through the other side, through the other leg, and threw it out. Oh man, I, I didn't mean to get in your video. That's okay. <laughs> A big old blue crab. That's crazy. Man, that thing is huge. <laughs> here, let me, uh, let me turn this camera so it's a little better in the sun. There's some light here. <laughs> cool. Oh, puffer. puffer. Yeah, it's a big old puffer. Smooth puffer. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 the ones I'm used to seeing, man, they got them big spikes. Oh, yeah, they got them real big on the, they stick off like that. These are the smooth puffers. Grab my pliers real quick. There you go, mine's right here. Look at 
teeth in the bank. <laughs> She's like, hey man. Here you go. Big old smooth puffer. Cool. Yay. <laughs> all right, everybody. So uh, I'm all done for the day. It's time for me to start heading home and go have dinner with the wife. Uh, it was kind of a slow day for fishing, even for this place. Didn't catch a single catfish. I mean, I'm not complaining about that. It's nice to not have to deal with a catfish because I catch so many of them, especially at this location. But it was kind of weird not catching any. But the tide was so low this this time for some reason, and it never went up. So I don't know why the tide was down so much this particular day. But we're going to head back home and call it a day. Hopefully, the next time I go fishing, unless I go fishing with somebody, will be on the kayak. So I am looking forward to doing that very, very much get away from all these areas where there's a lot of people fishing go do my own thing and go find some fish do some actual real lure fishing and, and and hopefully catch some keepers i'd love to get some mangrove snapper some sheep's head um snook when they're in season trout when they're in season um i'd like to catch a redfish for once they're not legal here in, in the Indian River. You can't keep them at all. But I'd love to catch one for once. I've never caught one before. I'd like to catch some black drum. I've only caught little dinky puppy drum out on the beach. I'd like to catch a nice big one. And just just catch some fish and bring you guys along on it on that journey. As we, we explore the Indian River on the Hobie Pro Angler 12. I can't wait. So... Thank you all for joining me. It's going to be a really awesome 2024, especially for the third beer channel. I can't thank you guys enough for all your love and support. We're going to blow this channel up and blow this channel out of the water. And I can't wait to be there with you guys all the way. Make sure you guys find the joy in life. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and the bell notification icon. And I'll see you next time. Take care. Thanks for watching the Third Beard channel. Here's a video selection and here's a playlist suggestion. Be sure to subscribe. Thank you.